Today I'd like to show you how roofs are constructed in some traditional Zambian houses and how they are repaired. I will be focusing on straw roofs, which are becoming very popular in modern home and bungalow designs. This ancient technique has come to symbolize eco-friendliness, beauty and a cozy atmosphere. Take a look at how fantastic a house looks with a traditional straw roof. Over time the roof deteriorates and needs to be repaired. Straw is laid on a wooden frame structure. The old straw needs to be removed. Today the workers are refreshing the roof. It's a routine process that requires some time. Let's observe how they carry it out. I'll guide you through the method of installing this type of roof, which is not overly complex, but demands experience and proficiency. How many days for the whole roof? One week? 13, 14, two weeks. To repair such a roof, a lot of straw is needed. That's why the first step is harvesting. Just look at how tall the grass was. Finding such grass in Zambia is not a problem at all. To start the work, the straw needs to be bundled into small stacks. This step I will call bundling. To make the work easier and prevent frequent trips up and down, the straw bunches are fastened on the roof. Two people are needed, one outside, another inside the roof. They take the straw bunches and sew it onto the roof. Then they smooth out the surface of the roof. So, layer by layer, higher and higher. When the work day is done, it's time to relax. Grilling fish over the fire, admiring the sunset, knowing how to unwind is a part of the doing good work. Tomorrow brings a new day and our workers will once again take on their tasks with best. Such a simple and amazing technology, from ordinary grass you can create a wonderful roof. The only drawback of such a roof is that it can easily catch fire. That's why smoking inside such a house is strictly prohibited.